With rumors leading up to both Samsung and Apple using in-display fingerprint sensing technology, it turned out that Chinese phone maker Vivo was the first to adopt the technology in collaboration with Qualcomm. A really short clip of the prototype was immediately dismissed as fake. Of course, it was a crappy rest video and a few seconds long. This video is about 2 minutes long during the learning process, the prototype takes a bit longer other fingerprint scanners we've seen lately, taking almost 2 seconds to register a scan while teaching the phone your fingerprint. Once the phone is handed off to the camera operator, the way he places his finger is a bit more critical. He tries to place his finger in other locations, and even halfway off the identified scanning area. Once learned, he teases the fingerprint scanner to see if a quicker scan is possible. After a several tries, he's able to unlock the phone with a short finger press onto the sensor. Last week, Vivo released a video showing off the capabilities of the sensor in a YouTube video and outlined that it used piezoelectric technology that essentially transmits your fingerprint to the sensor under an OLED display panel by using ultrasonic signals.